Hey, what's up everyone? I'm Carlos and welcome to another episode of Brooklyn Fragrance Lover. Today I'll be reviewing a new release from Tom Ford called Mandarino de Amalfi Aqua. Brooklyn Fragrance Lover Mandarino di Amalfi Aqua is part of the Private Blend Neroli Portofino collection and was just released alongside Sole de Positano, which I just recently reviewed here at BFL. Let's have a look at the packaging. Mandarino di Amalfi Aqua comes in a white box with the light blue label here. Gold Tom Ford on the top. Here is the bottle private blend shape, but it's a lighter shade of blue than the Neroli Portofino and Neroli Portofino Forte. Tom Ford on the top there. There's your spray. And your packaging for Mandarino de Amalfi Aqua. Mandarino de Amalfi Aqua was released in 2017. Some of the notes include mandarin, lemon, basil, spearmint, shiso leaf, and jasmine. It comes in a 50 ml bottle for 152 and a 100 ml bottle, which is this, for 208. For those of you who watched my Sole de Positano review, you remember that it was nice, but wasn't that great for me. It lasted only two hours on my skin and then evaporated and it wore really, really close to the skin for those two hours. This Mandarino de Amalfi Aqua projects much better for my skin for about two and lasts on my skin for about four. It's brighter and I really, really like it. It's green summer, it's fresh, it's just a little bit of mint and a slight floral. It's not overbearing, I don't think too feminine if you're scared as a man to wear a floral fragrance. It's blended very nicely. It's great and going to be great for a hot summer day. I haven't experienced a hot summer day because it's still spring here, but I really, really like this one much, much better than I did Sole de Positano. This vaguely reminds me of Creed's Hardin de Amalfi. Now, the white floral component of Mandarino de Amalfi Aqua is not quite as sharp and piercing as in Flor de Portofino from the Neroli Portofino collection. It's much more tame and in the background, so really a guy will have no problem rocking this. And also, I think it's good for all ages, young, older, just the clean, fresh summer scent that you'll enjoy wearing. Albeit, you may have to refresh yourself after four hours, but with me, it's no biggie. I'll just carry the can with me and refresh and just go about my day. Well, that's all I have for you today on Tom Ford Private Blend Mandarino de Amalfi Aqua, short and sweet like I always do. I'd love to share two 5 mil decants of this. Also, two 4 mil Mandarino de Amalfi, the original. By the way, the original is an Eau de Parfum. This is an Eau de Toilette. With two lucky subscribers, you'll get a 5 mil of this and this little guy of the original. All you have to do is subscribe to Brooklyn Fragrance Lover, like and share this video, then leave one comment down below with what your favorite Tom Ford private blend of the Neroli Portofino collection is. And that's it. Good luck. Thanks so much for watching. I have a lot more content coming your way. Collabs with Steven, collabs with Stephanie, a lot of stuff. So keep it tuned to Brooklyn Fragrance Lover. Hope you all are well, and I'll see you at the next review. Take care. Hey, what's up everyone? I'm Carlos and welcome to another episode of Brooklyn Fragrance Lover. Today I'll be reviewing meaning, and then it gets closer to the skin, but never quite as close as that Sole de Positano. No, Sole de Positano. Yeah, I'm so confused. And it wore really close to the skin. With this Aqua de Amal... It has a touch of it. This vaguely reminds me of Creed's Hardin de Amalfi. The white floral... Floral.